Well, here's what the screen looks like of the TomTom Tom 60S as an SM. And I apologize for um, the way it looks because it's dark outside. As you can see, I'm sitting at, uh, at the rest area. Um, and then, but I switched on the daytime um, mode. But basically, there's your route, right? And you can choose either uh, north. You can choose either uh, north up or straight up, right? Like for example, now it shows the actual way the road is going. Highway 401 going southwest. There's a lake, right? You can click this button here, and the route changes to uh, basically the road will go all the way always will be pointing this way right now the screen looks kind of fancy uh, really 3d and then on the right you see here there's information your ETA basically shows your ETA and distance and you can change you can choose kilometers or miles and when you drive over here at the bottom it'll say what road you're on now over here we got this like a couple of dots you click on that and you get into this screen where you can uh, pretty important you can uh, change the the volume or or you can uh, mute it altogether and then over here you can choose you can choose the um, daytime mode or nighttime mode Okay, so now this is daytime mode. I'm gonna go back. And then over here you have this. I mean, it's really like I don't like this too much because it's. I'm used to categories, you know, like menus where you can um, search for a specific category over, of, um, you know, place of interest over here. All, all you see is just search. That's where you enter, you know, either the address or part of a name. You see, enter an address or name, and then here you change uh, where near me or different different town. Uh, I don't know. Like you don't have categories. Then this is a uh, uh, current route, so here you can uh, you know edit your route, find alternative, avoid something on this route, and and this is all by the way. This is all touch screen. Right, this is traffic and safety cameras. My place is that's where you add some custom points of interest. Uh, you can find parking, gas stations. Right, so basically, there's just two categories that you get parking and gas station. What the heck? And then, over here, they have connected services. If you want to pay some money, they'll give you traffic and safety cameras. You see, now it says offline. So so I'm a bit disappointed in this, you know. I was expecting a typical menu uh, mode or setup, and here we go into settings, right? So here's uh, that's where you change the appearance. You can change the size of the text and buttons, you know. Just it switches to night colors, of course, automatically, and uh, you know what is this? Automatic zoom based on road type okay 3d well, you see it only gives you either 3d or 2d in direction of travel which I don't think sounds like where's north up if I choose this one then the road will always point straight up I know it's supposed to be an advanced uh, advanced uh, model so these are maps that's where you change maps. I don't know why would I want to do that. And here you ch you choose how you plan your route. So for example, I want I want to be asked what to do, and I just was punching in like my first destination. It never asked me anything. See, there's fastest time, uh, eco-friendly route. Oh, I like this one. Yeah, most eco-friendly, so you can save fuel. This is good. And that's it. Sounds and warnings, language and units, you know. And then we have this. 
uh, where it gives you a guided tour. Okay, so this is good. See, to select a location, press, hold, and release. That's something new. So you can just choose a location on the map and right away it shows you what's happening there. See? And to drive to this location, tap the drive button. Yeah, so 3D guidance view is shown automatically when you start driving. Of course, you know, in a city it looks good. You can see uh, like the buildings the way they are. And to change the view, tap this button. Yeah, okay, that's what yeah I showed you guys before. You tap that one and it changes from this. Okay, to change the route, I guess you uh, tap somewhere, tap the route for options. Okay. And then you can do that. Yeah, it seems like, you know, it's like learning a uh, different language. So you gotta learn. To open the main menu, okay, you click that one, yep. I already learned that myself. To navigate to an address or point of interest, tap search in the main menu. Yeah, that's what I figured. See, there's no categories here. Ah, okay, so you can just type uh, the word like restaurant or truck stop. And yeah, of course, I didn't do this yet because I just got this uh, in the mail today. You know, like I bought it two days ago on Amazon, it costs about 200 bucks. So that's it. So got a tour about TomTom Tom Go 60. Installed maps, you see US, Canada, and Mexico. Why did my light come on? Oh, okay, I guess it's catching the too much darkness from the outside. And that's it. So the voices are pretty nice. It's uh, Samantha. I'll show you guys how she talks. Language. English, no. Come on. English, country, units. English, voice. Oh, okay, it was uh, over here. Sorry, your yeah, voices. Hi, I'm Samantha. I can read aloud signposts, road numbers, and street names. All right, is that all you can do? Jeez. You have reached your destination. Oh wow! But you see, this one does not read street uh, names. You have reached your destination. Yeah, and this this guy again, he does not read uh, uh, names of streets and roads. You have reached your destination. You have reached your destination. What is this? English Island. You have reached your destination. Ben, New Zealand. You have reached your destination. Grab your jandals, togs, and chili bun and get going. <laughs> Cheers for the ride, mate. <laughs> Wow, let's listen to that again. You have reached your destination. Grab your jandals, togs, and chili bun and get going. Cheers for the ride, mate. <laughs> oh, another. You have reached your destination. You have reached your destination. Katrina? You have reached your destination. Wow. Lots of, um... Ha llegado a su destino. Oh, really? Well... Spanish, oh yeah, so Spanish Mexico. Ha llegado a su destino. Well, but, so the only voice that you basically can use if you want to uh, hear the names of streets is this one, Samantha. Hi, I'm Samantha. I can read aloud signposts, road numbers and street names. Yeah, that's it. So that's a quick introduction to uh, 
Tom Tom 60s 200 bucks on Amazon. Thanks for watching.